Coming up next, a matchup for the UFC heavyweight division title. championship fight, but not since this man has held it down. Tonight, looking to defend his title yet again. We'll see if he can keep that trend going here tonight. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the reach advantage. It's another thing to use it. We'll see if he can get that jab going. He has got to fight tall. He's got to stay at range, use his length to give his opponent problems, trying to bring the fight into a closer distance. He engages in the single collar tie. Great punch landing with so much power. A couple of chins here being tested early. Nice jab, falls up with a nice right hand. Good series. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. In Gano's strike attempt there is blocked. Oh, single collar tie here. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. It's time to look for that. Oh, huge left hand from Francis Ngannou. Every time he loads up and extends, you feel like the fight might be ending. Yeah, absolutely. And the whole crowd holds their breath. Right. right? You hear a big exhale. Every time Francis loads up to go finish a fight, you hear the crowd the take all the air in yeah. because they're ready to explode. That's the type of control, that's the type of fighter that Francis is. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Look at that great work to the body from the clinch. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, he's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Landed that left hook. Look at the turtles in that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, it's not due to a lack of effort. He continues to throw, but this is like double A striking. This is not high level. Yeah, you can't be missing. It takes so much energy to just throw a strike. Oh, action right there. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. You see a tweety bird over the top of his head. If you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly leg. One, two there. Oh! Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad now. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Good stick. Oh, right under the elbow, right on the perfect. It was a perfectly placed shot, and you see his opponent reacting violently from that point. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> what a round. All right, so that's the end of the round. Pretty significant damage done in that round. Cut on the cheek, sustained there from that strike. Now the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Better to be below the eye than above it, sure. But nonetheless, this could be a factor now moving forward. All right, round two. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Ngannou. And he continues to work the body here. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Nice body. There's the jab. There's another one. Big strike. Big 
strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fist. Whoa! Yeah, he's hurt really bad. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Whoa! He's out! Holy smokes! What a performance! Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. The decision is inside the octagon. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata calls a stop to this contest at two minutes, three seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. So there is the man they are all still chasing in the UFC heavyweight champion, the undisputed king of the big boys, getting it done here tonight by way of the knockout. And his corner is absolutely thrilled with the effort and the result here tonight. He was measured, and when there was an opportunity to seize the finish, he certainly steamrolled right through it. Congratulations to the still.